everybody. This is another Super Geeks production. Today, what we're gonna do is uh, do some SSL sniffing with Eater Cap and um, SSL sniff, ARP spoof, and uh, we're gonna have to change a couple of proc sys files. First thing you need to do: start your network. You need to connect to the network. Then what you need to do is open either cap. But don't click on anything yet. Leave it up. Next thing I want you to do is type in echo one and then the rest of the text. Just do that. Press enter. Then I want you to do IP tables, NAT, free routing, dash P, TCP is the protocol. Dash dash destination port will be the port we're going to strip from SSL text mode. Dash J, redirect to port on our machine, 10,000. Next thing you need to do is you're going to have to ARP spoof your are uh, your address resolution protocol in for the attack or victim to his NAT will start to think that your IP address is the routers along with the MAC so you will start to receive all the information in the middle so in order to do this it would be smart to run an end map against the, the subnet that you're on see what ports are open see I'm connected to a couple of computers on some subnet and we have a couple of nodes available so what we're gonna do now is bypass the the page where the invalid certificate would view itself on the victim through SSL stripping this will enable us to receive more passwords more promiscuously. So I'm going to pick this address, one, let's say 104. I want to ARP spoof this. So I'm going to do ARP spoof dash I interface dash T node, then what you want it to look like, which would be the router 101.1. .1. Anyway, press enter. You'll get some replies saying that your IP and MAC are now the IP of the router, the gate default gateway that you're on. Since you have successfully done that, you will not have any problem achieving passwords promiscuously without a certification error. you to scan for host and go to the host list well, I'm going to open up this again for some reason my host didn't pop up unified sniffing WLANO that's who I'm on right now my interface scan for host host list I want you to put the default gateway on target 2 and then all other targets, which are nodes, or victims, on target 1. I want you to click on there in the middle, ARP Poisoning, Sniff Remote, and click on Plugins, and Manage Plugins. Go to Repoison ARP. This will repoison the ARP after every broadcast address expires. This is good for staying connected. Now I want you to start the sniff. Now what I'm going to do is go to a host computer that is on this default gateway subnet I'm sniffing and type in a password.
put ASD, ASDA, and ASD, ASD, ASD as the password and username. I'm going to click next. As you can see, I achieved the password and username in SSL stripping mode without the certificate being viewed on the victim computer. So, I would strongly recommend you using Ether8 for your tests. When you are done, of course, stop your ARP applies. Congratulations, you have now successfully used your cats to sniff SSL and TCP, UDP, and NetBIOS shares. Like, this information should be used for informational purposes only. SuperGeeks.com cannot be held liable for any maneuvers or tricks learned here.